So I'm here with Gabrielle Lipnut. Can you tell me the name of the company you represent and yes. where you're based? So we are based in Lithuania. Our company is Elastum.io. It's basically a cryptocurrency uh, exchange uh, where you can buy uh, more than 20 coins directly with Euro or USD uh, in under two minutes. Uh, so if you will if you will show me the easiest way to buy it, I will give you a cocktail. So yes, so this is about us. So um, what is your interest in being at the summit here today? Yes, yeah, so basically my interest was I, I'm very selective to the uh, conferences. So uh, when I reached out uh, the CEO of, of um, the uh, conference organizers, so uh, I really thought that this would be a good event. So I, I was part of the panel, um, how we can um, streamline the cross-border transaction and business-to-business -business payments. Uh, so this was one of my goals, just to, to network. Uh, and, um, and another goal is probably just to find um, a high quality uh, products which are already finished uh, of the crowd sale are not an ICO and they have a good utility behind their token so we can um, list them on our platform. And um, being in Malta, what can you comment about the um, blockchain regulatory framework? Um, do you see that there are any challenges within it? And how do you think it can attract um, further businesses? Yes. So basically also, uh, thanks for reminding, one of the uh, my third goal was to just to check, you know, everyone is saying that, you know, Malta is becoming crypto heaven and everything. So so it was also, it actually the first time I'm in Malta. and. Uh, it was also my interest just to find out is it really uh, is it really like government backed you know is it really regulations are coming so even we have a prime minister of Malta being in a conference you know he is present I think it's very important so um, I, I would say that I heard what I wanted to hear uh, so there is especially from the exchange perspective uh, Malta has issued uh, you know a clear guidance that there will be a re license required in a year period so I also like spoke with a couple of uh, projects uh, who are applying for the license and I incorporated in Malta so they are saying everything is fine you know the regulations are coming which is like for Good projects, regulations are good, yes, because it brings more trust to, to end user. Uh, but the one thing uh, they are unitedly saying that to open the bank account for crypto related project is it's very challenging. So, uh, so I think this is the uh, regulations are good. But they need to work on the trust and bank, uh, you know, to influence them to to really either do a better due diligence. OK, we can stay longer. We can do a better, you know, we can do a longer onboarding process. But uh, but, you know, we we need, you know, that they understand us. Yes. Yeah? So so we are like, you know, we are not shady business. We are doing a full KYC. We are totally compliant and and everything. So. So I think that, you know, uh, for Malta, the same as for the rest of the world, there is a place to grow in the banking sector to be, to, you know, to put in place some regulations, policies and uh, procedures in the banking sector. Yeah, um, that's true for sure. Um, and last of all, what do you think of the summit so far? What are the key points you have taken and um, what was your experience on the panel? So uh, actually, uh, the event is, is very, very good. I, I didn't thought that it will be uh, so much valuable people. Uh, uh, the, the events even has changed like last year. Um, many events uh, were like more focused on just the hype, you know, like uh, they, they even don't understand and uh, what they're coming for. And then in this event, I, I barely met someone who is you know who is not following the market maybe they are new but they are interested they know the difference uh, you know within a critical things like Bitcoin is not uh, the same as blockchain and, and so on so so I think that uh, event is, is, is very very nice and Malta is, is very nice I was yesterday in Valletta so uh, yes the food is amazing <laughs> so very exciting um, thank you very much for giving us your time it was a pleasure talking to you okay thank you so much guys you have the best in the network uh, of Malta <laughs> thank you yeah.